Some low-income families need help with childcare costs while parents work or attend school. Childcare Services delivers financial assistance and much more. But how do providers know if families they serve are eligible to receive assistance funds? And how do you request reimbursement? This short video provides a brief overview of what you need to understand about the program. First, a few words about eligibility. Here are a few things you should remember. Child Care Services determines if an applicant is eligible for assistance and issues you a certificate explaining the amount of assistance the family is eligible for. Even if a family receives assistance, they may be required to cover a portion of the bill called a co-payment. The assistance doesn't cover additional fees like transportation or field trips. Based on your rate, there may be a difference after both child care assistance and the co-payment are paid. That difference is the family's responsibility. In order to receive reimbursement from child care assistance, you will be required to complete a provider rate declaration form and sign a provider agreement. Reimbursement will not exceed your advertised tuition rate. Now let's cover things for which you as a provider can receive reimbursement. The actual hours of care you provide while a family is working or in school, non-care hours per Head Start, school district preschool, or absent day policies. Please see Provider Reimbursement Guide for details. Please note, you can choose to request reimbursement either once or twice per month. Also keep in mind that to remain eligible for payment, you'll need to maintain sign-in and sign-out records, calculate the amount, and report it to CCS who will process the payments. To request reimbursement, download and complete the Request for Payment form. You can find it on the CCS website or use the online billing system. You'll receive payments within 15 working days by check or direct deposit. Family child care providers may also choose debit cards. To understand more about this program, eligibility, and requirements, we encourage you to visit the Department of Social Services website, where you can download a comprehensive guide that contains all the relevant details. Keep it handy. Thank you for your interest in this program and for working toward the best interests of children. Your work helps South Dakota's families and its economy remain strong and vibrant.